Hi Saints, this is Curtis Palmer, just coming today with an encouraging word. At this stage of your spiritual growth and development, uh, there will be a lot of conversation going on in your mind that doesn't line up with the Word of God or the character of God or the Spirit of God. And the enemy uses this as a time to have you operating in uncertainty. Try to make you believe that if you were where you need to be with the Lord, that these conversations would not be going on in your mind. That's a lie. That's part of the human nature. Keep in mind that Satan still has access to heaven, where he goes before God each day accusing you. So, and because of that, uh, the human nature not being redeemed, he still has access to your mind to try to encourage you and distract you from serving God. That's not the evidence of your spiritual growth and development. The evidence of your spiritual growth and development is through all of this conversation and distraction that's going on in your mind, as you encounter situations each day, regardless of what spirits that you are encountering, what do you do and what do you say? Is your response to these situations based on the Word of God doing what is right? That's the evidence of your spiritual growth and development. That's the evidence that you're being led by the Holy Spirit. So. Let's not go for that distraction. There will come a time in your spiritual growth and development, even though these thoughts come to you, you will not be distracted by them. You will not be in uncertainty of whether you're truly following the Lord or not. That comes with time. Uh, what I'm trying to do right now is help you shorten the learning curve. With that said, this is what you do. Now we need to be about the rest of our business, which is possessing our circles of influence and our minds. Recognize that spirit that is at work in that encounter that you have. It may be someone operating in anger, uh, lying, deception, uh, whatever. Because that spirit influences that environment. And remember, it always starts from the head. We are here to possess the land. Call that spirit into submission and the authority of your Lord and Savior Jesus Christ and command it to leave that environment uh, leave your mind because you possess that space for the kingdom of God through the authority of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ and the victory that he accomplished for us through his death, burial and resurrection to empower us to have victory and to rule as God's servants and ambassadors here on earth. That's what the enemy doesn't want you doing. See, without this understanding, it may take you 5, 10, 15, 20 years before you really realize that you were following the Lord, that you were walking in obedience, but you were so concerned and focused on uh, whether you were or not because of the uncertainty, uh, you didn't possess the land. So let's possess the land whatever environment you find yourself in. And remember, the enemy works from the head. He always works from the head. God works from the head. Whatever environment you're in, see where the head is and how the head operates because it influences everything underneath it. Take authority over that spirit, command it to leave, possess that place and the authority of Christ for the kingdom of God. Invite the kingdom host to come in to assist you by moving in that environment. Uh, so that the Spirit of God and the Word of God will uh, move in the hearts and minds of people that they will be sensitive to righteousness and justice and equality for all, doing what is right. Keep up the good work. God is well pleased because you are blessed and highly favored. Uh, and God is leading you. The Holy Spirit is good at what He does. Is good at what He does. So, uh, continue to move forward in the Lord and don't be distracted. Always remember, is what am I saying and what am I doing? Does it line up with the Word of God? That is evidence that you are spiritually mature and continuing to grow. Because it's about discerning what's of God and doing what pleases God. Thanks. Have a great day. Need me? Hit me up at any time.